Mark Zeck, quirky inventor five times over, submitted a pretty simple idea. He hated wrapping up his cords and the excess cords associated with plugging something into the wall. So we designed a simple product called the cable collar. I think the function dictated the shape on this project. Um, we had certain things laid out for us that we needed to achieve and we tried to solve that in the most elegant and uh, efficient manner. This might be one of the things we do moving forward is just like initially you really like print out like a very quick down and dirty model that we can actually build on Bertha and immediately put ourselves in like the real world. I, I think this really kind of gives us a good starting point for where we're trying to get to, right? Like now we can see, okay, these holes need to be like different sizes. We get a feel for like exactly how much cable could actually be stored on. This design is, um, the idea is it's going to flip over the existing faceplate. What you do is loosen it a little bit, slide it on behind there. And we're finding some issues with actually getting a good fit when you screw the faceplate tight again. And beyond that, we could just do it that it replaces the faceplate entirely. No, people, no, people wouldn't buy that. Here's my, here's my recommendation. You can make whatever decision you want. If you go universal, you're probably in really, really good shape. Okay, so the idea of this one is that it's very simple. You don't have to mess around with the faceplate at all. You don't have to unscrew anything at all. It's held in place by the actual fixture of the, um, the plug into the socket. You just put this in between. Plug it in, bam. I think a flat back is probably the most versatile option. Yeah. Major design changes uh, when we decided to go with this form factor was to remove a portion right here. Um, removing a piece of material in, in this spot could, would help us uh, be able to attach longer plugs. I mean, if we could, we'd make, it, we'd make it less wide. But you can see here that a lot of people have cell phone chargers that kick off to the side. And at this point, we're, we're entering this, this shape into um, SolidWorks and working with that. So the next steps on this is like really fleshing out the design, making sure it looks beautiful. These are kind of like down and dirty mock-ups. We're hoping the final version, just with a few tweaks, is going to be a lot more interesting visually. One of the concerns on the community forum board was that there were several people who didn't want it to become like a huge eyesore. I think this product will not take away from any interior design that you might have going in your room. It won't take away from your living space. Um, it won't overpower anything. When the cable collar goes to market, we're, it's really going to kind of tie in with the, the power curl. I mean, this thing is basically a power curl for the wall. And this is really where you see like Quirky developing lines of products and developing categories. This thing sits on the wall, you wrap up your cords, and boom, all the clutter is out of the way. I knew this thing was going to be an incredible hit as soon as I saw what the community did with it and what the staff did to overcome some of the inherent design challenges with making this thing a universal device. Great job everyone, get pre-selling, we love this thing.